Yeah, our show's actually called Ramen and a Half, so I thought it'd be cool if I brought my dentist the wrong bowl. Yeah. Hey, this is. Hey, this is Ramen and a Half. We're here at the Kid Robot San Francisco for the Frank Kozik signing event. Check out this line. Hey, it's Frank Kozik. I'm here at uh, Kid Robot, San Francisco on lovely Hate Street. Spare change. Anyways, I'm doing an interview with you guys. So, of course, this is Eddie with Ramen and a Half. And Frank Kozik. So, um, today you are uh, doing a signing for the stand up Skeleton Labbits. That's right. So, what did you come up with the idea for that? Hard to put that together. Well, actually, like one of the first labs I did along many years ago with Metacom in Japan, like 10 years ago, was a sort of a standing skeleton rabbit that came with the So I always wanted to do them, even on all fours, I always wanted to do them with big upright figures. And uh, it's just really good because, uh, you know, you have a display option. You can be cute or you can be evil looking. Whatever mood you're in that day, you can just turn them right. Oh, uh, yeah, that's pretty badass. And um, another question we had, uh, it's actually a question from a friend of mine, is why rabbits? Like, out of all the animals, like, is there a story behind that? Or? I don't know. I just, um, you know, most of my toy designs are animals. I love, I personally really like animals. And uh, I don't know, everybody likes a little bunny, right? <laughs> Especially if he's, you know, kind of like not a very good little bunny sometimes. <laughs> right? So it's just kind of a, I know it had to be. Uh, okay. So, out of all the work you've done, which ones did you have the most fun working on, or which ones stand out to you the most? Are there any that are your favorites, or are there all like your children you work on? It's kind of like, I mean, for me, the whole thing has uh, been just a big, long project. It's almost 25 years now of doing stuff. And so, kind of like whatever I'm doing now is the one. So, the way I work is, uh, you know, I do stuff, and then kind of like once it's done, I forget about it, and I'm on to the next. So, for me, it's, it's just about always doing something new. And keeping interested in like new things, and uh, I've had a lot of fun lately, like doing my own dresses and stuff. That's been kind of like real satisfying. So you've done like so many work in the past, or so much work in the past, and like you're constantly working on things all the time. How do you find the time to do all of that with all the different projects you have, like your robot and your own stuff? And else? Well, uh, you know, basically, um, what people don't see is. Uh, you know, I have like a really nice work space and I'm really into organizing things and so I have like every tool I need like all ergonomically laid out in different areas in the studio building and so it's like whenever I get any kind of task whether it be like 2D or 3D or fine art or whatever digital or hand drawn like all my stuff's all laid out and so basically I have a daily schedule. I keep a daily schedule I work like seven days a week, 10, 12 hours a day, right? get up in the morning, go there, do stuff, and like that's what I do, like that's my trip, you know? And like when I'm not at work, I'm working on the house or building cars or whatever. And, you know, luckily, uh, my wife also works with me, so it's not like I'm there by myself, right? But I mean, that's just what I do, you know? Like, I, I don't know, it's like I, I make things, that's what turns me on. So it's like I actually hate going home and sleeping, like rather you know, can't right. wait to think. Right. Every morning, as corny as it sounds, I wake up every day at six. I'm stoked to go in and do stuff. You know, it's like uh, I like making stuff a lot. <laughs> so, real quick, where can we find you? So, anyways, yeah, I do. I make. I do lots of really uh, limited releases all the time. Handmade stuff, hand hand figures, uh, special prints, and I'm pretty easy to find. I'm on Instagram. I've got two Facebook pages and a Twitter account. And everything is just Frank Kozik. It's under my real name, and uh, you know check in daily because there's updates every hour basically and I show new products at least three four times a week so if you want to get the latest lame shit that I make, <laughs> check it out too. On social the blog. and the blog, the blog. Yeah, that which is on my website sales site which is uh, frankcozy.net and uh, as some of you know like I'm pretty I keep up pretty good with that so all the new stuff gets so shown here. Cool. All right thank you. All right.
Travis. Alright, so I'm here with Travis, and uh, what you got uh, assigned today, my friend? I got a two tricky sign, I got love and hate, nice little duo right there. 